All right, guys, so probably not gonna have much luck, but since we haven't uh, recently, but this would be deck on number four on the list. I'm probably gonna slow down here uh, on decks for a while because these are expensive. And maybe if I make some sales on Mercari, that will change, but this could be one of the last decks that I do an opening for. So, luckily the uh, brush fire decks are, in my opinion, I think these were one of the ones that were more likely to have shadowless cards. So my hope is not completely lost and I know the odds are against me. So there's that too. It does have this nice seal all the way. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but nicely, this box is a little dented. Doesn't, probably really doesn't make uh, a big difference, but um, it just looks like a regular box in my opinion. So, but on the listing, it said very old and honestly had some debris in it uh, on top of it. So it just looked like it'd be sitting in an attic or something. So I'm excited about that. Uh, obviously the card is in the front. Those are the only ones that I choose to buy. Um, I'm sure they can be found in the bottom and I still open up those just to see, but anyways, let's uh, get to it. So first I have to find where to open this. I wonder if this is honestly a tight seal because it is very like, I don't see any tab to open this with. So, which is kind of unfortunate because I don't want to mess out the box. Oh. Definitely don't want to mess up the box. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'm just tearing it up, I guess. Oh man, this is the worst way to open up a deck. I can assure you that. In fact, I'm going to just see if I can possibly, oh, I just want to tear it across the top. I know, I know, everyone's cringing who sees this. That's definitely going to be the case. I'm trying to keep it all intact. Okay, it is all intact. I doubt it's going to ever go back on the same, but it is all intact. Maybe we can actually keep the packaging somewhat on there. Uh, not likely, honestly, not likely. It's got some, some, uh, it's got something here. It's coming off, but that's kind of gross. Anyways, okay. <clears throat> oh gosh. Can I get this thing just opened up enough? Maybe keep this on here. Keep the plastic slightly on there. Oh. Radio, the deck is at the bottom. Right, I did not think that far ahead, okay? Cellophane's gotta come completely off. <sighs> well, regardless, it is a brand new brush fire deck, so without further ado, <clears throat> here we go. I am not going to look at it, I can't even see. Here we go. That is a regular base deck. That is a bummer. That is a bummer for sure. But I still think these are gonna be worth a fortune in the future and I did it for fun and they're still highly collectible. So that being said, this is still a super cool looking deck and it sat in someone's garage or attic or whatever for 20 years and I think that's really cool. It's brand new, that's just dope. Anyways, see you guys next time.